Okay, last example for this chapter. The whistle from a stationary policeman at junction emits sound of frequency of 1000 Hz. So if the speed of sound is 330 meter per second, what is the frequency of the sound heard by the passenger inside the car moving with speed of 20 meter per second? Okay, so sekarang ni, uh, the source is not moving. It is stationary. And then it produces a frequency of 1000 Hz. They gave us the speed of sound, which is 330 meter per second. And then uh, the observer is moving with a speed of 20 meter per second. Okay, so again, let me try to copy this. Copy. Okay, so sekarang dia punya uh, source is not moving. Okay, and then the observer is moving. Okay, so it is moving towards the junction. Okay, so it is moving towards the junction. So, direction dia macam tu lah. Okay. So since this is, they are in opposite direction, the speed of sound dengan the observer punya speed, we are gonna use plus. So V over V plus V S. Uh, F S. So this is uh, three thirty, three thirty plus yeah. Sauce, sauce. Oh okay, see lah. Sorry. <clears throat> so V plus V of observer over V F S. So three thirty plus twenty over three thirty. So F S is one thousand hertz. So three thirty plus twenty over three thirty times one thousand hertz is one zero six zero. One zero six one. No. One zero six one hertz. Okay. So now when it move it is moving away when it is moving away from the junction remember sound can be produced at both sides huh? I mean the direction of the speed of sound they are other produced both here and then here gini 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 Okay so if kita di sini kita tengok yang bahagian inilah kalau kita di sini kita tengok bahagian ini all right okay so this one is like that so this is the same direction with the uh with the observer so f is equal to v minus v not v f s so this is just changing the into negative lah okay so that we're up then 1000 you get 939 point. Actually, I'm gonna round it off. 940, yeah. So, 940 hertz is the frequency of the frequency heard by the observer. Lah. Alright. So, that is the solution for example 13. Uh, if you want to know whether you are doing it correctly is anything that moving to... If it is moving towards the source, towards the source, towards the source kan, frequency dia mesti greater than moving away. Okay? Kalau kamu dapat ini lagi besar dari yang ini, maksudnya ada salah lah tu. Alright?